happening now. NASA's Space Launch System rocket now on Launch Pad 39B at Cape Canaveral. Yeah, so it had a four mile journey from the Vehicle Assembly Building starting yesterday evening. And Randy Hildreth joining us live in studio this morning. Randy, this is the rocket that's one gig to take Americans back to the moon, and it is quite uh, ominous sitting there. It's a big, big size. Oh, right. So a lot of excitement about this this morning. The rocket is now again officially in place this morning after the slow journey to the launch pad. The Space Launch System will carry again astronauts back to the moon and eventually to Mars. Now that it's on the launch pad, crews will begin preparing for what's called a wet dress rehearsal. That means it will be fueled up and preparing for a countdown like a practice. It allows crew, crew members to kind of get in that mode to practice uh, what happens immediately leading up to launch. Now, if all goes well, that rehearsal should happen in about a week. The actual launch is expected no sooner than May. NASA's Artemis program will pave the way for humanity's giant leap. Future missions to Mars. There's no doubt that we are in a golden era of human space exploration. And when we talk about the excitement about this, the Artemis SLS rocket is the first moonbound rocket since Apollo 17, which is about 50 years ago. Amy.